Hi guys, it is Angel from PRDB Entertainment. Welcome to another lesson of the Unreal Engine 4. Now, on this lesson, I will teach you guys how you can work with the materials and realistic, uh, realistic textures. So, for this, I'm going to be using the Crazy Bump software. So, I can create my normal pictures and the diffuse ones. And only these two, we are going to be using those on the uh, on the Unreal Engine so we can import them and add it to a material so we can add the material to an object on the scene so I'm gonna go to the crazy bomb software and I'm gonna open up a rocky texture that I just downloaded and I'm gonna use the first shape you can choose any of those two if you want depends on what exactly do you want to do so I'm gonna choose to save the normal picture as you can see here the normal one is, uh, looks like blue and the diffuse one that is the uh, original picture so I'm going to save the diffuse one first and I'm going to put it on um, rocky texture okay I already got him here okay and for the normal I'm going to do the same thing okay so now that we have those two textures what do we need to do next? We're going to create a folder. It's going to be materials. Inside materials, I'm going to create another one. It's going to be called texture. And I'm going to import those two textures inside this folder. I'm going to say yes. And now I'm going back to the material folder and I'm going to create a new material. It's going to be named Rocky Texture. So double click on the material so you can open the material editor and now let's take our folder from the textures and let's drag the two textures that we have for this material. So the diffuse one is the normal picture, the original picture. So we need to link that one with the base color and for the normal map we need uh, to link this one with the normal. So now we have everything set up here so we can look real the material will look real so let's save it and let's close the window there we go and now let's add this material maybe to this box it's going to compile shaders uh, already did and as you can see looks way way much better now if we take off the normal texture and we save it with the original only From here, you can see the difference. It doesn't look real. So, let's open up again and let's add the normal texture back. I'm going to do it from right here so you can see the difference really quick as soon as this changes. So, I'm going to save it. And there is your realistic effect. Ah, really easy, huh? Well, guys, this is Angel from PRDB Entertainment. Hope to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.